Okay, I got one of these old style vacuum cleaner with a bag that you can just put on. And my wife told me she was cleaning the roller and the belt came off. So um, this can happen uh, or your belt can break and you have to replace it. This is a Sears robot model. Uh, 208.1740 2.5 amp and uh, I looked at it and I see a belt removal uh, hole here there's a screw that you can unscrew you don't really have to unscrew all the screws that are holding the vacuum cleaner together just unscrew this one and then there's a cover plate. I didn't know this uh, before. I didn't bother looking up the manual. I don't think I have the manual. And then when you open it, you can access the belt. And you have this uh, retainer here that you can pull off and you can look at the belt. And if the belt was broken, of course you replace it and you pull it out and you notice it says you have um, on here uh, rotation only in this direction so you have the arrow pointing down so when you replace this make sure that this arrow is pointing down that way so you just take the uh, belt out or if mine this here is still good so I just put it back in I don't have an extra belt anyway so put it back in here, push it all in, vacuum cleaner facing you. The belt is slightly off center to the left, right? And then over here, when you try to put the belt back on the shaft, you, you turn the belt to the left like that. Right? You just put it like that. If you do it the other way, if you flip the belt the other way, you'll come off when you, when, when you turn on the motor. And of course, make sure your motor is off, or make sure that um, you unplug the uh, back from the uh, AC before you do this. Or if you accidentally turn the switch, the motor will run and then you, you hurt yourself. Alright, so after you put this thing on you um, screw it back on here there's a screw or before actually before you screw this on you have to put this cover back on because a, the screw would pass through that hole in the in the middle there and hold the the uh, plate in the cover in place so you put the screw back in and then you tighten it with your Phillips screw screwdriver so I took out the vacuum bag and I dump all the dirt out and I also clean it right? there's no other bag, there's no paper bag this is like a the uh, the filter for all the dirt also at some point you probably have to replace this but this just clips on in the back so after you screw the thing back in make sure it's tight all right check the belt position check the arrow spacing down put the cup of plate back on push it in just snaps in Plug in your vacuum. This is two speed, and then just you look at the rotation of your roller. It's supposed to rotate this way, right? Down. Well. So now it's working again. Sears Craftsman Power Mate. I wonder if they make this or sell this 
anymore. Alright, thanks for watching.